Ready. She sat in the back as her brother Boyle turned to his best friend Cat and said, Drive. John Cale, anyway. Never. John Cale's Welshman. He's not. He's American. A New York man. I'm telling you, he comes from Ponty or somewhere. In a car. Then what does he know? My brother wants to turn a piano for Linda's van. That's what I know, mate. Last time they're in the rank in town. Right, man. Look what happened to them after that. I'm not a hit since. That's not the point, Sid. No, the point is, it don't matter if Gil came from fucking Burnwood. He's living in New York now, see? And I bet that's where he's gonna stay. <sighs> I mean, can you imagine Lou Reed walking around Burnwood? <laughs> All right, Lou, how's it going, Wats? Like on the wild side? No way. Not cool enough for him. He's probably never been heard of Wales. He don't know nothing, that's why, Sid. Clark. Trip to America. You right, I reckon? Bollocks, man. It's a big country, man. Eh? Plenty of work there, too, Boyle. Plenty of space. Plenty of sun. Plenty of sand. Fancy riding across it. A Harley Davidson. Chasing the sun. Money in your pocket. Tiger in your tank. Hendrix on the Walkman. Just free. Moving west. You can do that on Pembroke, sir. Pembroke? Yeah. Don't give me Pembroke. What happens when you reach the sea? I tell you what, it's the end of the line, mate. I don't know. Lie down on the beach, look up at the sky or something. Yeah, watching the rain come down, no way, mate. And what you do is wait for low tide and ride hell for leather across the Atlantic. Huh? Mm -hmm. Watch out, there's a wave. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Anything to say? Um, can you swim? Don't give me that shit now, will you? Oh, Sid, man. Fuck off! Oh, come on. Don't be like that. I was only having a crack. Oh, is that what you call it? I'm sorry. Look, I'm your brother, for fuck's sake, not a piece of shit. I said I'm sorry. Look, things are going to get better, man. You just, you just got to give it time. Time. I'm pushing 30, for fuck's sake. I'm going to shag for 18 months. Well, it's longer than that. It's about two years, isn't it? So fucking what if it was? 18 months, two years, what's the difference? It's all Mickey Mouse, anyway. I gotta get out of here, Boyle, before... Before your balls explode, man. Typical, that is. <laughs> Bastard typical. <laughs> <laughs> Mom? I've run out of paint. Is it too late to get more tonight? I'm sorry. I didn't mean to upset anyone, but no one understands. No, obviously not. I don't want to go back to the hospital. Don't send me back. Well, it'll, if it'll make you feel better, Mom. No, it'll think... make me worse. I panic, that's all I... I worry. About what? It's all the open cast's fault. I don't want you and your brother to work up there. Oh, come on, Mum. It's workman. Jesus, I thought you'd be happy. Well, I would be, but... They're only I... digging the mountain. They won't come near the house. Is that what you're afraid of? This house is all we've got. It's coal they want, not houses, Mum. This house is full of lies. What lies? Kept us together, that's the main thing. But now Sid and Gwenny want to go to America after him. But there's nothing there for them. Gwenny's been writing him letters. 
How do you know that? I've got eyes. I can see. But I know you are on my side. I heard you calling your father a bastard. I think I haven't got years. Yeah. On the side you're at by the looks of it. Don't laugh at your mother. I'm not laughing at you. Ah, oh, leave me go. What's my father got to do with anything, anyhow? Everything. He's not in America. He's never been to America. All he ever did was dream about America. Everybody knows he went to America. Lies. All lies. What the hell's wrong with him? Oh, you know Sid, man. He's still a bit touchy. Well, he died there, you know. Yeah. Prefer the way it was. <laughs> Orange, by Jesus. Engine by four. Aye, fair play, man. She goes like a bullet. Two-litre engine, overhead camshaft, twin choke. Weber's reconditioned the works. Yeah. Great, man. Aye. You wait till Sharon sees me in this, mate. A jammy bastard. Women and Capri's jelly and blue ones. <laughs> when did you meet her, then? A couple of weeks ago. Oh, yeah. Nice, is she? Fucking gorgeous, man. She's a typist. Do I know her? No, she comes from Stoke. Mirror glass figure. Hourglass. She got nice jugs, that's all I know. Hey, I'm a friend, does. Hey, I can get an introduction if you want. I'll have to come to town, mm. though. I'll lend you the money. So what are you doing with the Robin, then? Fucking scrapping it, what else? Straight up. Straight up. It's nice for you. It's crap. It's a car. 50 quid in instalments after I get myself a job. He ripped you off, man. I've just got to look after it, that's all, man. I wouldn't be seen dead in it. No one's asking you to be seen dead in it. I think it's nice for you. Yeah, it's only got three wheels, ma'am. But three wheels is enough. It's only three quarters of a car. Typical of him, not all there. Oh, bollocks, man. I'll come for a spin with you, boy. Yeah, go on, boy. I'll take my for a spin. Yeah. Been nice to get out. I haven't been out in ages. Yeah, we all know why. <laughs> what was that you said? I said you'll enjoy it, ma'am. Come on, ma'am, get in. Enjoy the trip, brother. Bye-bye. No, I don't want to fucking play, all right? I just want you two to stop and look at yourselves. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> He's not in America, Gwenny. Where'd you get that from? Your room. Snoop. It's a Mickey Mouse address, Gwenny. Mam made it up. How do you know? Well, it's bastard obvious, man. Clem Lewis, Main Street, Dodge City, the West. She got it out of a Western. I don't care. You get it, Sam. Oh, don't be so soft, man, Gwenny. There's a million Lewises in America. I don't care, all right? I don't care what you say. You're not gonna stop me. Sidman, talk to her. What is there to say? Well, you can tell her it's bollocks and help me do something about it. There's nothing we can do. Well, there's got to be something. <laughs> Sidman, it's me, Bio. Talk to me, man. The only ones for me are the ones who burn, Boyo. You got me. I told him there and then. Keeps a good secret, your brother. So where is he, ma'am? 